Are you sick and tired of gambling your hard-earned money on Madden packs? Well, look no further than my sponsor, MMOEXP, for the cheapest and the most reliable mug coins on the market. And don't forget to use code FURTY at checkout for 5% off. The link for their website will be right at the top of the description. Are you looking to take your Madden game to the next level? Look no further than Sybil.gg for the best ebooks on the market. Choose one of two membership options, and don't forget to use code FURTY at checkout for 25% off. What's going on guys for our second Christmas gameplay of the day we are looking at the brand new legend Walter Payton because Christmas has fallen on a Saturday we got both gifts and legends on the same day so definitely a crazy content drop today. Before we hop into it though, about half of you guys who watch the videos are actually not subscribed. So if you right now watching this is not subscribed with those notifications on, make sure you go ahead and do so so you don't miss a single gameplay, a single tier list, or a single upload. And whenever we hit big milestones, I love to give back to you guys. So right now, we actually do have a 30k giveaway live right now over on my Twitter. Um, I'm giving away three $25 gift cards. Doesn't matter what console, anyone can win, anyone can join, anyone can enter. Um, some pretty easy steps. Just go over to my pinned tweet. Links for my Instagram, my Twitter, all that stuff is down in the description. Okay, so here is the 95 overall legend Walter Payton and Walter Payton gameplays are always very special to me because yeah, a Walter Payton gameplay is what got this whole channel started. I um, mean, yeah, the first ever gameplay, first ever upload on this channel was a Walter Payton Christmas gameplay. So it's kind of cool to see, you know, I guess it's not the same exact card it was a zero chill card back then. But now it's a legend. This it's not a legend in 22. But you know, Walter Payne gameplays always have a special place here on the channel. But yeah, 94 speed, 94 acceleration, 92 agility, 93 awareness, 91 jumping. Can even return kicks if you need him to. Good strength as well. I mean, for like an elusive slash receiving back, which is what his archetype is. I'm sure a lot of you guys just kind of assumed that Walter Payne was going to be an elusive back, but no, he's actually a receiving back archetype, which is kind of unique. I feel like he's usually always just elusive back, but they also gave him really good receiving back stats. I mean, like. This Walter Payton card is at like a Christian McCaffrey or or Alvin Kamara level or Alvin Kamara level of pass catching out of the backfield. So 85 catching, 88 short, 87 release, 83 mid, 78 deep route running. So a really good pass catching card as well as you're gonna be able to put like the one AP backfield master on him, stuff like that. Uh, 93 carrying though, 92 ball carry vision, 95 juke, 94 spin, 94 truck, 92 stiff arm, 90 COD with a 95 break tackle. So this Walter Payton card can literally do everything, can run guys over, make guys miss, catch passes, run by people. Um, he also does weigh 200 and he's 510. And hopefully EA did this card right and gave him the one-handed running style because if they did, we're going to have some fun. And people, I saw a bunch of comments saying hopefully he, he, he's as good as he was in Madden 20. No running back will ever feel the same way that they felt in Madden 20. Like if you look at Madden 20, you know, Madden 20 stick work and how they, how fast the gameplay was in Madden 20, it'll never correlate to Madden 22. So, I mean, yeah, I've, I love Walter Payne and Madden 20. I love them. I mean, I love them. I used them. I think I used his Christmas card. Then I used Bo for like a little bit and then I went back to Walter Payne. But yeah, I love his card in Madden 20, but there's just, I mean, I, I don't want to, I don't want to compare Madden 20 Walter Payton to whatever this card's going to be. And I think he's going to be really amazing. So I'm definitely excited to see what this card can do. And for the abilities, like I said, he's a receiving back. So kind of some unique abilities today. I'm probably just going to use backfield master, but does get bulldozer 2 AP, which is kind of cool. Maybe that's why they made him receiving so they could give him like bulldozer and stuff. So he can kind of be like the best of both world kind of scenario, but also red zone threat as well on this card, which might be interesting actually i'm probably gonna run i only have room for one ap so actually i'm gonna run backfield master for sure i've been liking leapfrog a lot though i really have but because i don't, I don't have a high round master quarterback right now so i'm gonna go backfield master if you do backfield master is still a good it's still a pretty good ability because you're you get added hot routes which i guess you don't need that if you have a hot route quarterback but it also does add your catching and your route running it's basically like route tech so i'm not sure what the point of having route tech is when backfield master basically just does the same thing I guess if you want to put him at like slot receiver, maybe you'd run this, but still 5 AP on route tech makes zero sense. So those are the abilities for Walter. Let's hop into it. By the way, for Kems, only was a bear his whole career, but I still think even not on a theme team, this card's going to be a good option. So let's hop into it. Let's see what Madden 22 Walter Payton can do. Let's see it. All right, here we go. Game number one with Walter Payton. And of course, we also do have William Perry. Um, of course, they did both play together um, on the Bears back in the day. And um, here we go, man. Here we go. Let's see what Walter can do. I am so excited. Does he have the one-handed running style? I don't know. I I hope so. Let's try a little belly run. Looks like the box is just stacked. And did he not? I, I couldn't tell. See what we can get off the edge here. A one-handed running style. He I think he has it. He has it. I saw it. I saw Flash. Not running the ball well at all right now, but I saw the Flash. Here we go. Let's see if we can get it going here. There's that backfield map. He actually was lurked at. We got 
Why is he not? He, like, he's not running with one hand in this scenario, but we're down the sideline. Um, we're not going to be gone. And I think we're going to get caught here by Jesse. But yeah, um, he doesn't have that one-handed running style. I mean, I saw it. I saw it pop for a second there. But maybe, maybe when there's guys close, he doesn't do it. I don't really know. But on that last carry, I did see him do it. But you guys, you guys just see how devastating backfield uh, backfield master is when you have a uh, man coverage on it. It is so devastating. It's route tech. It's slotomatic. It is so busted. So see if we can get it here on a run. Um, there, you, see, you see it pop there for like a second. There's that juke animation and Walter Payton. He, this card feels good so far, man. He, feel, he feels like Walter should. Again, don't compare him to Madden 20 Walter Payton. Don't, if, if we get a Dickerson this year, please don't compare him to Madden 20 Dickerson because... You will be disappointed. I I can promise you that. Give me off an edge here. A little cut. I shouldn't even cut. I should just spun probably. But yeah, I, I'm really. I've been really struggling running the ball recently. I don't know what it is. Even yesterday on stream, I couldn't run the ball that well. It was a tough go for me, man. Yesterday in the last couple of days running the football, and I've been doing a lot of running back gameplays recently. Kind of went on a little bit of a drought, but then we had um we had Vita Vea. We had we had that whole gameplay yesterday. We had Adrian Peterson. And, um, and now we got Walter Payton. We're going to have Ricky Williams gameplay as well today. That should be a touchdown right there for Walter. And um, kind of a slower drive, I guess. But, um, yeah, that was actually a really slow drive. Um, hopefully, I can... So, actually, no, we had, a good, we, had a big, we had a big play on that, actually. Never mind. I forget. We had a, we had a big play on that, on that drive. So, that actually wasn't bad. All right, here we go. There's no way this man doesn't use her, Walter. But, hey... We'll see. No, he, did, he didn't. Get it out. Attaboy, T Attaboy, Tim. And so, hey, actually, yeah, good drive. Got the touchdown, two-point conversion, had a big play. Uh, and by the way, the Walter Payne you're seeing right now is actually not power up. So this card can get one speed technically better. If you do power him up and you don't have a Bears team, if you have a Bears team, though, obviously, you know, you can't get plus two speed on top of that. So, yeah, and this card's got 95 base speed, right? 95 base speed, if I'm thinking. No, 94 base speed. So 94 speed on, on, the, on the card you're seeing right now. And obviously, yeah, there, there are going to be some faster DBs than... than um, oh, my... I thought he broke that tackle, but yeah, there probably are some faster DBs in the field right now. Because everyone at this point, or a lot of people have, you know, the strat cards. Whenever I say everyone has them, people always say, dude, I don't have them yet. Yeah, I, a lot of people have their DB strat cards and stuff, though. And most likely have theme teams out there, so that's kind of makes sense. This guy's got a Washington football team, theme team. I saw Scary Terry. Um, I, I came out of field goal block on the first drive, as you guys probably assumed. So I haven't seen this guy's offense yet. But I'm going to come out. I'm actually going to try to get a stop here against this guy. All right, coming out like a bunch look, maybe verticals, rolling, 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 goes over the top, and Ty Law is too small. You know what I mean? So instead of just, just running the ball over and over again, get out, Walter. Go, 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 go. Broke a tackle, Walter. Let's go, baby. I'm kind of disappointed that he's not running the ball one hand, though. It's just kind of a cool thing that I kind of wish he had. Let me lose. Find a hole. There we go, Walt. Oh, I got stuck on, I got stuck on Devontae. That kind of sucks. Unless he lurks me, which he... Didn't spin that Walter. There's that spin move. If you guys wanted to see that, and like I said, I mean, he he, he can outspin people, can make people miss. You know, using his juke animation, can break tackles, can run people over. Um, his weight at 200 might make it a little bit harder to run him over, but he does have that capability. Um, with the, what was that, a 92 truck, 95 truck, I mean the 92 stiff arm. So he has that capability, which is definitely nice to see for sure. Let's go right back. I mean, if he's, if he's gonna play man coverage. I don't see why he's don't run Texas routes the whole time. And you see just how nasty that is, bro. You see how nasty the journal. There we go. Touchdown. Let's go, Walter. A little risky, the journal without leapfrog, but I don't care, man. Touchdown. Oh, handstand. Okay, Walter. Is that how y'all got down back in the day? Okay, Walt. And yeah, by the way, if you did miss the earlier gameplay, the Derrick Henry gameplay, that video is up on the channel. So if you want to see some Slinger 1, Gunslinger, Escape Artist, Derrick Henry, yes, that gameplay is up. That card probably already showed up on your screen already. So you probably already saw it, but that was a very fun gameplay. And I did sell my Derrick Henry. I bought him for like 450 earlier in today or earlier today. And I kind of wish I bought a bunch of them because Henry's price right now, it, it was yeah, it went up to like eight eight ninety. It's coming back down now, but it's still eight hundred K, which is still kind of wild to me. But yeah, eight hundred K. Um that, that card was going for a lot. And I do yeah, I have come to the conclusion that William Perry is the best fullback in this game. Get open. Get open, Walter. There we go, Walt. Go, 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 go. That is Taylor Mays. Get it. Oh, there's that one hand. There's the one hand. So I guess it, I guess it shows up every once in a while. There it was though. There was the one hand. Hey, there it was, man. That made me that made me happy. Running with it. I knew he was gonna do that. I actually have X in the back of the end zone. Oh my Tim, 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 Tim. Does so this actually go to a pass play here? Oh, is there even a pass? Oh, there is, there is, there is. Pass play, put Walter on a Texas. This this man could get butt naked here. It's zone, it looks like. Oh, Walter's open. Go make a play, Walt. Oh my goodness, go throw from Tim. Let's go. Let's go. Walter down the sideline. One-handed running style. Score, please don't catch me. Please, let's go. Oh, he let me. 
let me let me score i swear it's not rigged i swear this is not a paid actor i swear j man 2k is not a paid actor that looked suspect i'm not even gonna lie if i were like probably like a 12 year old kid watching this video i, I definitely would comment ferdy pays ferdy pays his opponents i would definitely comment that that i definitely would be commenting that right now so i better see a couple comments all right guys so that is going to do it for the walter payton gameplay and I'm not going to lie, I kind of like that he's a receiving back. I, I like having that 1 AP backfield master, especially right now. I mean, if you have one of the 8 AP gunslinger hot route master, or sorry, I keep doing gunslinger hot route. If you have one of the two gunslinger escape artist quarterbacks, even if you have gunslinger hot route, it's still pretty expensive AP wise. So being able to save an AP on backfield master, if you like hitting your running backs a lot, is definitely nice. And like I kind of said, even if you have hot route master on your quarterback, having that like route tech on Walter Payton definitely helps out a whole lot. You see the separation he was getting. Um, the card felt good. Um, good animations, good spin, good juke. Was I mean, he had a couple broken tackles. It was only one game, so kind of a small sample size. But you can tell this card's going to play really well. And he, he will 100% be on my team. Like, 100% will be on my team once his price falls. Because right now, he's still a little bit pricey. I, I, I mean, he's still, he's still got a little price tag on him. I'm not going to lie to you. So I'm definitely going to be holding off a little bit so that price falls. Um, I'm not going to be spending a 700k, 900k on a running back. Or no, like 800k actually, but I'm not doing that yet. But I, I do love this card and he will 100% be on my team. I do think he goes right into that conversation with, I still want to try out Ricky. I still think Ricky could be better than Walter, but I think he's right in that conversation with Bo, um, AP, and uh, you know, we have Walter Payne there. I just want to see what this Ricky Williams card can do. That gameplay is coming up next. So make sure you are sub with those noties on or in the Discord so you guys are notified whenever I do post that video. But that video is coming. I'm also very excited for that gameplay too. So like I said, if you're new here, hit that subscribe button. And as always, I will see you boys in the next one.